Ladies and gentlemen, hello! Welcome to the Bleach Brave Souls Anniversary Round 1 News Flash. I am your host, Caleb Salesperson number 5. This video is not endorsed by Caleb in any way, shape or form. Starting off with our brand new, never seen before original designs of Ichigo and Byakuya, which are redesigns of Ichigo's full brain form and Byakuya's hack taken. Introducing the all new Power Leap. Witness one-fifth of your beloved hard-earned characters become obsolete with the release of only two new characters in the what the f*** are you doing K-Lab power tier. Fifth anniversary Ichigo and Byakuya. But I want to use my favorite characters Mr. K-Lab. Do not worry kiddo, just steal your mom's credit card and bring it to me and I'm sure we'll figure something out. Remember the nerd headband and the thick nerd glasses? Throw these accessories in the trash can where they belong. Now with the all new Marauder and Sharpshooter skills, you can ignore resistances altogether. What about guard break you might ask? Have no fear gamers, the new Marauder and Sharpshooter skills will break through normal guard as well. Speaking of Byakuya, are you handicapped? Perhaps suffering from Parkinson's? Or perhaps you're just the average mobile gamer sitting on the toilet wiping your ass while playing. Well, I have important news for you. First, fucking disgusting, bro. What the? F Second, our new Byakuya's vortex homes in on enemies, so even if you cannot aim or our flawless auto aim feature somehow does not work for you, do not worry. Just close your eyes and press Byakuya's vortex, and the game will do the rest. Do not forget to tweet the hashtag BBS Accessibility to show how caring we really are. To celebrate our fifth anniversary, we will be giving players the chance to acquire an ultra rare mind special move resource through our fifth anniversary point event. The last time this happened was only six months ago. We hope this hooks you on our special move resources enough for you to buy our very reasonably priced subscription, which offers you a generous one rainbow special move source every three months for a price that is just above a full price AAA video game. Don't forget to tweet the hashtag BBS generosity to show the world how generous we really are. Remember the guild quest revamp? All the blood, sweat and tears you put into grinding and transcending units just for one week of guild quests. Wipe your tears and ready your credit cards, gamers! Because our 5th anniversary Ichigo and Byakuya are the new best units for 6 out of the 8 rounds of guild quests. But that's not all! To finish our highly anticipated 5th anniversary banner, we have carefully handpicked the fillers to be disgustingly bad. But have no fear, our supporters and loyal fans will happily and politely inform you of how good the fillers are using lovely arguments such as it has fierce battle Eisen, there are seasonal characters, and f***ing entitled gamers shake my head. Do not forget to tweet out hashtag BBS civil discussion after every civilized discourse about our lovely anniversary on the internet. And that wraps up our 5th anniversary news flash. I was your host, Caleb salesperson number 5. <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, hello again. Semi-serious thoughts on anniversary. Uh, my hype died down a bit after I saw the gameplay which was leaked by Hiken, I think. The gameplay, the, d don't get me wrong, the gameplay, is, the gameplay is great, it's just certainly not as flashy as I'd like it to be. And I, t I don't really play this game for competitiveness or getting an edge over other people. I just play it to get my favorite characters, the coolest characters I find, and use them. And part of my enjoyment of using them comes from how flashy their moves are and how satisfying they are to click. Ichigo's design still looks great, even with the weird Evelyn tail from League of Legends they decided to give him. I don't know why. As for the ridiculous power creep, I <laughs> fully intend to make a video discussing that in depth later but yeah it's it's quite ridiculous to me and i do not like that they keep doubling down on taking the game in this direction and focusing on making other characters obsolete instead of focusing on making the gameplay better and making everyone use whatever character they want uh <clears throat> i will be discussing the fillers before summoning in tomorrow's video but my advice is do not go all in whatsoever on this banner the filler pool is hilariously bad and I would strongly advise against going all in. At the very least, wait till round 2 is announced. I mean, look at this shit. Look at it. Look at it and cry. <laughs>